from Web 2.0 to Fuel 2.0. eFuel brought this setup to Demo Fall 2010, suggesting that consumers use household waste to produce ethanol and fill up their cars in their own driveways. Hi, I'm Tom Quinn, founder of the eFuel Corporation, and, and this is our uh, energy conversion system. Uh, the first one is called the microfueler. The, mic the, the principle of the microfueler is to convert fermented waste that it contains uh, a mixture of water, nutrients, and alcohol, and it processes this into ethanol fuel, which can be st stored in the tank and, you know, lift up the handle and pumped right directly in your car. Uh, the magic inside is right here. This is the column distillation system. Uh, the waste comes into here, is vaporized through the uh, stripper, and then the rectifier up here does the, uh, uh, the final uh, blending of the fuel, so it's fuel gate quality. This is then the, uh, the uh, grid buster itself, which uh, the fuel from this system can go into here and then power your house uh, or heat your house or provide heat for the power of the uh, microfuel itself in a heat exchange system. And the only component that's missing today is what I announced, which is called the uh, microfusion reactor. The microfusion reactor is something that will help assist you in taking wood mass, paper, and what have you, and quickly, in a matter of minutes, turning that into a sugar water so it can be properly fermented for the microfueler and speed up the process and the availability of a biomass that you can use uh, in our products. So do you see people as putting these in their driveways and powering their cars? Or? Absolutely. I think we're going to a more of a micro uh, fuel and energy distribution system versus a central, very much like uh, when IBM had the mainframe and Apple computer went to the microcomputer, those that signaled the, this transition. People are looking for more freedom, lower cost in their energy, and more control over their energy in particular. And having a micro fuel managing system there allows this to occur.